Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. I'm gonna jump into a quick Dollar Tree haul here. It won't be very long because it's not too many items. I'm gonna start with the physically biggest things first. I got some more wrapping paper. I'm addicted to Dollar Tree wrapping paper. Um, they have so many fun, cute designs. This one is from the Christmas movie Elf, which is one of my most favorite holiday movies. And I bought a different Elf wrapping paper last year. This one looks like it's a different design than what I bought last year. And these are the extra tall, extra wide, however you want to consider that, rolls. Um, here's the 20 square feet. So, and another fun one that I got is the, uh, this is from, let me see if I can get an image here so that you can see. It's from Christmas Vacation. Where's a good, okay. There's the glass mousse mug that they picked up at Wally World. And the Santa from the roof. Oh, here we go. Here's Clark Griswold. And I thought this would be a fun one. Um, sometimes our family does the white elephant gift exchanges where you can steal presents. Oh, how cute, a bottle brush tree. Where you can steal presents from each other and I like to get kind of goofy wrapping paper for that. And then I got some minion wrapping paper because I have a friend that just absolutely loves minions. And oh my gosh, look how cute this is. I hadn't even looked at it in detail. There's little snowflakes made out of minions that is just absolutely adorable. I had already picked up a different roll of minion wrapping paper. Um, oh, and they're wearing ugly Christmas sweaters. How cute. Um, I had already picked up a different minion wrapping paper and uh, then I saw this and decided I had to have this one. And then my last Dollar Tree haul, I had picked up some of this Disney Princess wrapping paper. It's more in pastel colors. I don't know if the colors are coming off true. Everything's looking a little yellow to me here. But um, it's a pastel aqua, and it's got um, the uh, several of the princesses on it in pink. And I just loved it so much. I've already got a couple of rolls, but I just wanted to make sure I didn't run out of this because I just absolutely love it. And then they had this brown craft paper wrapping that it's not as tall, not as wide as the others, but the quality of it just absolutely looks amazing. Here's a cute Christmas sweater with Santa on it cups of chocolate, mittens, and this just does not look like, it looks like a Hallmark wrapping paper. It's just absolutely adorable. So here's a really cute minion gift bag again for the same friend that loves the minions. So we're gonna do a little, little editing out of order here. I always forget to look at the sides of the bags and the side of this minion gift bag has more of the little uh, snowflake designs made out of minions. Isn't that cute? I'm gonna have to go back and get more of these, I think, um, because that, as I said before, is just adorable. So anyway, now that I've added this edit in, we'll get back to our regular stuff. And I had wanted one of the um, Disney calendars, and sorry for the glare, I'm using all indoor light here tonight. Uh, I had wanted to get one of these Disney calendars. I'll show you all the images on the back. And I had managed to find one before, but it was intended as a gift for a friend. And I had hoped to be able to find one for myself. And, um, and I was lucky enough, it looked like I possibly got the last one. So yeah, I was real happy to find that. I picked up a couple of puzzles. This one is, sorry again for the glare, I'm using my indoor lights. This is a 48 piece puzzle, uh, a Lisa Frank puzzle of a Pegasus with rainbows. And this one is just absolutely adorable. It's cupcakes and macarons and cookies. And the, the image goes around the side of the box with, with more. And it's a 300 piece puzzle. And it says that there's a free cupcake recipe inside. So I was really happy to find that. I kind of dug around, oh, here's a cute little, like a little cookie house here. I had to dig around in the puzzles quite a bit to find, to find that particular one. There were others that were cute, but weren't quite right. And in the little stocking stuffer toy area, they had this cute little wind up train. And um, I'm actually going to, I've been anxious, I wanna open it, because this is just for me. I like to play with toys, especially at Christmas time. Who am I kidding? I play with toys all year long. But uh, I want to actually open it up and see how it works and show you guys how it works. Oops, just dropped something on the floor. So continuing with the Christmas mode, I picked up a headband. 
with the two little Santa Dealey bobbers on the top. And I normally, I love, I love silly headbands. And I normally don't go looking for them at Dollar Tree because some of them just don't look like they've constructed as well as I would like. But this one caught my eye and it looked really nice and, and cute and, uh, and, and very well made for a dollar. So that'll be one of the goofy things I'll be wearing at some point during Christmas here. Well, good enough. Okay. I found this adorable, they had a whole bunch of different styles of pop-up books and I might go back to look at, at what else they have, but this is the Christmas pageant. I picked this up for my little four-year-old cousin and as you can see the, the figures pop up there and then it's got a little story about the Christmas play. And there's only about four, four pages, but it's just really cute. And I know when I was a kid, I always loved, sorry, I don't have enough room to get everything on the camera here. I always loved um, pop-up books, so for a dollar, I thought that was really cute. I actually picked up four of them because I had four gift opportunities that I could use that for. Minion Band-Aids for the friend that loves the Minions, and there are 20 Band-Aids in here, and this is what they look like, which is really cute. We've got Kevin Stewart and Bob. Actually, we've got, yeah, which order? Yeah, Kevin, Bob, and Stewart. That's what order that's in. And hopefully you don't think that's sad that I know that. <laughs> and I picked up, I already got into these because I needed them for some gifts that I was already giving away. I got a three pack of um, Finding Dory. If I remember correctly, the other packs, one of them was Hank. No, no, was there Hank? No, one was Dory and one was the Otters. And then I got um, some cute Barbie tissues too that I had to already put into a gift. I picked up some nail stickers, and this is my first time. I have not really tried the nail stickers before, but these are a really cute red. The color's not coming off quite right here, but they're red with uh, little holographic -y silver stripes, and I'm not any good at doing stripes on my nails, so I thought I would give those a try. I picked up, I had seen someone else haul this set of tweezers, and I've been looking for them. I thought they'd be great for craft projects or when I'm doing nail art with uh, little gems to stick on my nails. So. I had really been looking for these. I think it's a great set for a dollar of four different types of tweezers. Um, I got, well, these are two of the same kinds of stickers and they're like the tape kind of stickers, the longer, the longer sheets. And I just loved the candy, oops, are we kind of upside down? We're upside down. There's candy and cook cookies, cupcakes, not cookies candy cupcakes and party hats and I just love candy themes so these would be fun to use for birthday cards um, you could even use them for Christmas cards if you're doing a Candyland type theme here we are with some sassy and sassy and chic sassy and chic say that five times fast sassy and chic little nail art gems and they're little um, let me see if I can show you sorry everything's looking so green here but um, I actually had tried one of these already, and these have been on a couple of days. I did this haul a couple of days ago. And it's actually stayed on much better than I thought. I, I bought two sets of these. There's little black and white checkerboard ones, pink zebra print, black solid, and then pink, black, and white, like a, a cheetah or leopard print. And just the solid pink and white here. And I bought two sets, because if I, if I liked them, I wanted to be able to use them again. And, and they may be reusable. Now I did, when I washed my hair, I did put on some thin rubber gloves because they do kind of get caught in your hair. But I've been washing my hands and doing dishes and they're still there. I am a, I am a little careful of them, but, uh, but they're still hanging in there. And these would also be really cute for craft projects, for cards and whatnot. So anyway, that's my haul and thank you for hanging out with me. I know it was a little crazy there for a moment. Anyway, I hope you're having a wonderful holidays. Good luck in your, your next dollar treat. Uh, next Dollar Tree visit and if you liked this give it a thumbs up I'd love any comments you have and be sure to subscribe if you like what you see thanks for watching